Welcome back to the show. John Holt with Jen Rosati, and in a minute we're going to hear from Christy Michaels, so one of your three freshmen, the only healthy one right yeah. now. As Caitlin and Mallory are both out for the season? Yeah, it's been a tough go for this freshman class. Mallory obviously uh, tearing her ACL back in December. And Caitlin, we just found out, will you know, miss the rest of the season because of a really bad ankle injury that we just couldn't play her through anymore. And, uh, you know, Christy's been holding down the fort a little bit, but as most freshmen, it gets tougher when conference play comes and those defensive expectations are there that they'll know how to guard certain guys in our conference right you know, you tend to go with your older guys. So I, I really would like to try to get her back into the mix because offensively she can really help us out with her three-point shooting and her ability to see the open guy. Um, but it's, you know, going to have to take her continuing to have good practices to, to build some trust there. Well, she certainly is delivering in the classroom yes. after her first semester. And Christy Michaels, the freshman, is our Coca-Cola top scholar. There are always expectations for Division I basketball players, and at Hartford, those expectations extend beyond the 94 feet of the basketball court. They extend, in fact, probably begin and end in the classroom. Freshman Christy Michaels saw it firsthand right away. Uh, they definitely enforce the study hall, and all the old upperclassmen remind us to stay on top of things and to go to study hall to do your work. And um, with the America East just this past year winning the scholastic honors that they did like throughout their whole sports program, I definitely want to keep up with that and uh, do well in my schoolwork just like the other students have the past year. Basketball, school, basketball, school, they can seem never ending to college newcomers. A lot of times I want to take a nap, and if I do, I have to remember to set an alarm, because otherwise I'll just sleep throughout the whole day, and I won't have time to get my schoolwork done. So, again, staying organized, I'll use my phone as a timer to wake myself up to continue with the rest of my day and what I have planned. Any help can, well, help, but it also takes personal discipline, focus, and organization to excel academically. I used to use a planner. I'll like write it down in class. Uh, people make fun of me a lot because I like overly use my planner. I'll just take it out all the time, but I would be nowhere with it. Christy has plenty of time before she steps out into the real world. Her current 3.74 GPA is an excellent start, though her future ambitions remain a work in progress. I'm not quite sure what I want to do yet. I first started off as a math major because that's been my favorite subject. But now I'm looking to um, go into international studies because I want to, uh, in the long run, I'd like to be able to travel with my job. So I'm hoping to mix the two of them and incorporate math and travel into some kind of job that I can get in the future.